Hey guys, this is Bear Gaming and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, we are going to check out Angelica's pool party costume. So there has been a, an emergency in tenants uh, this morning and I was supposed to record early in today but since the emergency maintenance happened, so I waited. But now it's over. So here we are. We are about to check out Angelica's pool party costume. If you can see, I'm here in Story Pack 4 or Cat Daddy Story Pack. It's because I was doing uh, recording videos about uh, different bosses in this current Story Pack. So I hope we're able to check it out. And if you haven't yet, uh, it's already uploaded in my channel. I'm still continuing because there are still some bosses that I haven't recorded yet. Oh, here it is. That is a school party costume. Looks really nice. Okay. Oh, that. Hey, I think it. Isn't it? It's only Angelica that's going to be released today, right? So I wonder why. I, I think I saw Sylvia, but it was cut out. I didn't press anything. But the video cut out. Okay. There are several items here. Okay, let's check it out. Here is the information on the Angelica Sylvia pickup event mission. Full party Angelica costume pickup event mission. August 16. So that's technically today. It's already August 17, but you know, the time difference. So, okay. And for Admiral Sylvia, that's on 23rd August. So I guess that will be August 24th here in Philippines. That's the mission and pick up rewards. That's the same as Jerizade and just TS. So that will let you know about the pickup event. Aside right from that, what else? Powder of Hope. Here is the information on costumes that will be sold at the Powder of Hope shop after the routine maintenance, which is today. So we'll be able to see Pool Party Latel, Pool Party Grey, Desert Flower Sylvia, Demon's Daughter Sayer. I think we already discussed that previously. I think I'm going to get Greys or Latels because gosh, I really need copies of those. Here is the Mirror War and Evil Castle Experience Season 5. So we are at Season 5 already for Mirror Wars and Evil Castle. And then, here's the exciting part. To commemorate the Summer Night update during the event period, the number of slimes obtained from the Slime Empire in the Path of Adventure will be increased. This event is applied separately from the daily bonus. So, during the event period, the amount of slime obtained from the Path of Adventure Slime Empire is doubled. <laughs> that would be really useful for us, especially, well, aside from building my Husbando team, I also want to try out building the other uh, heroes here that are girls so I want to check them out probably I'm going to make a waifu team also in the future so we'll see about that then Sylvia Pass here is the information on the newly introduced character pass event Sylvia Pass is content, uh, consists of various missions for a total of 7 days upon completion of the mission you can obtain Sylvia Pass experience along with rewards if you raise the pass level with the acquired experience points various rewards will be paid Oh, and you'll be able to get Sylvia's exclusive gear in SR grade, not UR, the Primulan, and also Sylvia costume, Desert Flower. So if you're building her, that means you have an opportunity to get another costume for you to awaken her costume. New packages can be purchased twice per account. Ah, okay, we already discussed that. Some packages can be bought using diamonds, 500, 1000, 2000, and some others also can be bought using with real money. Pickup event notice. We will inform you about a new pickup event that will be held after August 6th. Delica Pool Party. Okay, again. 
for today, it will be Angelica up to August 30th and on August 23rd, it will be for Sylvia. So it's just Angelica for today. About the emergency maintenance. Okay, here we are in the town. <laughs> And we are going to check out Angelica's full party costume. You can see the pickup event over here. And we can also draw one for free. And also here for her weapon. For Shadow says it's still two. And also for Justia. So let's try Angelica's first. I noticed something new here. You can see this 4 star or higher. E probability. Okay. 1.5% for Angelica. Here we go. Okay. So I think the changes have applied here when it comes to the PT. Remember. They made some changes when it comes to the summoning and I think they are giving out the PT summon. Healer. Also hope that they are going to like enhance the skills of the 3 star and 4 star characters so that we will have a variety of characters to choose from. See? This one? Guaranteed draw. When you draw a 3 star or 4 star costume, the count increases by 1. When you draw a 5 star costume, the count is reset. When the count reaches 100, you can get a 5 star guaranteed costume. See? The guarantee or or should I say PT? But I'm not even sure if this works over here. I mean, after 100 summons, you'll be able to get Terrace costume guaranteed. I'm not sure about this, or probably any random 5-star characters. I have to check on that. Oh! See? We were able to get another UR, just for free, here. By summoning one time, and that's for Bernie. <laughs> it's really good. Oh, what's this about? Oh, four star. Oh, wait. So, I'm going to try and pull for Angelica's costume. Even though I'm not really using her, it's just for collection purposes. That would be good. Because we have a collection database, right? So, let's try. Mm, probably we can just skip that. So obvious, so I was able to get Hayden and who's this again? Sami. Hmm. We have Layla, Sami, and Rai. Or start costume. Ah, this is a guarantee. Value of gems. Okay, it's taking a while for us to get one copy of her costume. Oh, wait! <laughs> Maybe this is it? Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> I won't say anything or confirm yet because we haven't seen <laughs> that it's happening.
Okay. Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> hey, here we go. Okay. What did just happen? Oh, okay, okay, I get it. You see, it's already reset. It's because we already got a 5 star character. So I think I was able to get her uh, costume on the 10th, uh, no, 7th pool, right? It was on the 7th pool. Okay. So in the shop, we can actually exchange for those. Golden threads, you can see I have already 1880. We can exchange for tickets, that's good. It would be really helpful in the future. Oh, four star! I need this because I really want to level up my Alec and even Lathel. So we can get various items here that are really useful. And also, when it comes to Powder of Hope. I have 180 only because I was able to exchange Grace B rank idol costume, B rank manager costume, was it from the previous event? But this time I was really planning to get another copy of either Gray or Lethel's. <laughs> so we'll see. I guess I have to keep on summoning, but you know, I want to use my diamond sometimes also because uh, since I already have my main team with me, which is my husband Do team, so. Oh, we got more stuff here. And let's not forget about the pass. Mm, oh yes, on level 10, we'll be able to get her costume over here. See? And on level 5, we can get the Primulan as our grade. Or Sherezade's Season pass, it's still ongoing. How about this? Pick up mission. More tickets. And the event exchange is still ongoing. I think I still have to get something. And I just want to check it over here. I think I don't have any costumes of Angelica before. Let's check. I think this is my first time getting Angelica. Ah uh, yes, this is the only one. And it says here, decrease incoming damage by 75% for 2 turns. Attack 3 times, each attack deals magic damage based off of 15% of target's max age. And you can see the attack formation. It's like this T form. And it's and it's kinda reminding me of Tetris. You know about that game. So that's my first time getting Angelica. And if you happen to check the collection or the costume or okay, character. Oh wait. Angelica. What does Angelica look like in regular form? Ah, this is Anastasia. Wait, is Angelica a new character? Like a real new character here? Ah, okay, because at first I thought it was this. This is actually Anastasia. So that's not Angelica. <laughs> Sylvia, Eclipse, Therese, Beatrice, Alec. Delia. This. Ah, okay. I guess Angelica is really a new character here. Not just a new costume, but a definitely a new character. Hmm, something tells me I really want to build another team. A waifu team, and that's going to be full magic. We'll see. It well it kinda it's kinda too bad because I kinda also want to use Justia. But she's a physical character. And, you know, uh, it's not really intentional. But as you can see, 
I have already plus five my Justia. And I just got her costumes like randomly from free pools and stuff. But when it comes to the pulling, uh, because I was also trying to get copies of Latel and Grey, but I end up getting more copies of Justia, so that's good at least. But remember, her skill is physical damage, I think. But when it comes to this one, I think she works as a knight. So creates an energy guard which is equal to 175% of max HP that takes damage for 4 turns. It doesn't say anything about physical or magic over here. And wait, we can see the profile already. So Justia is just 15 years old? For real? Her birthday is on February 11. So this is something new here. We will able to see the profile of the characters. <laughs> what I dislike playing around at the dinner table. So line. What is it? Okay. Of course, I'm going to check out my husband team. <laughs> How about that then? Ooh, he's 18 already. Memorizing the names of herbs. For all his herbalist. Yeah. 35. Oh. <laughs> 35. Thirty-one. How about <laughs> Wigan? <laughs> Doesn't have any age. Gets a little excited when April 1st comes. So probably that's his birthday. <laughs> Ton of explosion. Self-destruct. Uh, okay, since we are here in Story Pack 3, I cannot open Rue. Nandesko? Wait, where is Sherzy? She's already 18, March 19. Oh. Just like my sister's birthday. <laughs> March 19. July 21st. It's really fun. You know, with this profile, this will help us become closer to the characters. I'm looking for someone that has the same birthday as mine. <laughs> well, there are still a lot of characters that are not yet here in my list, so probably you can see them here. Well, I'm not really that... Um... After... <laughs> But yes, let's check several ones. Let's see for this. Can we check her? Probably it's from the costume. If we want to check our their profile, let's see if that actually works. Let's say for all. Ah, okay. If you want to check out their birthday, even though or profile, even though you haven't gotten the character. So you can actually go here. April 17th. She's really close. <laughs> How about Letris? I think I see a lot of characters here with their birthdays on June or July. And February. Uh, oh, Leap Year. Who's that? I think it's... Yeah, F29. Her birthday is on a Leap Year. That's unique. I was born with dark It's too dark. How about this one? Okay, November 20th, 22nd. March? Okay, uh, I was just making sure that they didn't mess up the birthday. <laughs> because it, it will become weird if they have two different birthdays, right? So anyway... <laughs> What else? Uh, we already checked. Since Anastasia, oh no, Anastasia, not Anastasia. Since Angelica is a new character here, I really want to use her. I think I'm going to create a waifu team. I think I already created before, but this is really not that good because when it comes to three star characters or other four star characters, their skills are not that really impressive compared to the five star ones. So. 
I don't know, maybe someday the developers would reconsider like improving the skills of the other 3 star or 4 star characters in order for them to be really usable. And of course guys, don't forget about this one. Summer Night is still ongoing. The event, based on the light here, based on the light here, just below, you can see this bar. The event is still ongoing. We are halfway through. So, just keep on doing this. Keep on exchanging stuff from Gray's exchange page because we are able to get a lot of things there. They are quite really useful. And you know, I've noticed something. Maybe this could be... Uh, I'm not sure if... Because I'm not really sure if you are experiencing... Oh, wait. This is not supposed to be my team. <laughs> team OG. Yes, that's my current team. <laughs> you, you've noticed that I... Oh, well, aside from noticing, I already informed you that I place the speed if you are checking my mouse cursor. I'm pointing this icon over here. It's times one for the speed. So from times two, which is the maximum speed whenever we battle, I just reduce it to times one. And it seems like... <laughs> Wait, I'm just checking. It seems like the, free, the screen is not freezing anymore. See? And we were able to press a lot of buttons, starting from getting the costume of Angelica and down to here, going to a different cartridge. So it seems like the screen is not freezing. Well. I don't want to get my hopes up, but I just hope that the developers already made improvements when it comes to the freezing of the screen. And I do hope someday that they are going to create a PC client for Brown Dust 2 because, you know, honestly, this game is really fun. I'm really enjoying it. Although, I really hope that they are going to create more male characters in the future. And I've already emailed them and they happened to respond to my email yesterday. And <laughs> they, well, you know. They would really say that they are just going to relay your message to the developing team, but, well, <laughs> let's see, maybe they will really consider that suggestion. Because I also want to have a variety of characters, especially male ones, because aside from creating husbando teams, I also want a variety of male and female characters so that we will have a lot of choices to create our team or to form our team. So. So far, so good. Green is not freezing. So I guess if you have the same experience as me, probably reducing the battle speed to one instead of two, maybe that would really help. Although it it's somewhat slow when it comes to the battles, but hey, what matters is the game is ongoing and it doesn't freeze from time to time because I really don't want to record any of my videos. That's why I'm kind of having a difficult time recording my videos like streaming them because of course I don't want to disappoint you guys. The last thing I want to happen is the game that keeps on freezing and you are going to watch me re-logging into the game every every time. That would be so annoying, right? So let's see. There, I think there are only three battles here in this area and after that you can just come back tomorrow. I already tested like coming back after a couple of hours probably six to eight hours uh there there are no battles so probably this happens just one time a day and i even want to use i want to create a team that's uh, the summer costume team you know there will be latel justia sherazade and gray all in summer costume plus angelica that would be fun and I'm going to try and because we still have a lot of hard mode videos uh, boss hard mode videos that I want to record so who knows maybe tonight I'm going to record one and I'm going to use my I don't know what what should I call it this is currently my husband team so for full party team so let's see so yes that will be all guys for today we discuss about Angelica's new costume and I, I think Angelica is definitely a new character here 
in brown dust too and also we were able to check here in this area the summer night event we're in we are getting the tickets because we are going to exchange this in a daily basis so currently i'm on the 11 attempt so all you have to do is just press change okay you'll be able to get lots of things and once you get the key over here and if you think that you don't need any of the items anymore and you want to check other pages so just press renew so that will be all guys for today please do not forget to subscribe to my twitch channel youtube channel and also please give my videos some love by liking them if you want to and i'm going to see you again on the next video and if you are a newbie i hope you are going to enjoy my videos when it comes to boss battles in hard mode and i hope it really it will really help you in your brown dust 2 journey this is bear gaming have a nice day, guys.